Don't forget to head over to HowToWrench.com when you're done watching this video for hundreds of other ones just like it. Hey guys, I just want to do a quick little video to thank uh, the guys at Road Rage Bike Works for uh, choosing me. They chose me to have them come in and do the, the Dyno 101 and then uh, from our you know, end of our uh, assessment, the end of our two days of training, there's uh, quite a bit more in that. I've got some uh, business training, parts management, service management, quite a bit. And I think that's one of the reasons to take a look at hiring me for your professional needs, whether you have me come into your dealership or whether we do it over the phone or FaceTime. Uh, we went through, you know, two days of, you know, Dyno 101. Uh, it didn't take much with these guys because they were pretty seasoned. We got a 15-year veteran, a GM mechanic, did crossover of the power sports industry years ago. And then the other guy, uh, I mean, graduated back uh, 89 from AMI, and he's been turning wrenches for a long time. So, you know, one of the things is you can't bullshit these guys. I mean, they've been around. They want specific answers. I got those specific answers. And when I didn't know the answer, we had to take a look at what resources do we have out there so that we can get a collectively get the right answer. Knowing what questions to ask are gonna be super crucial into being a successful technician or business owner. And sometimes you need to hire someone like myself to come in that's got 20 years experience, in this case, 15 years of dyno experience, to know what questions to ask. Uh, this, this dyno had not worked from day one correctly with all its features or whatnot. the owner and the number one man here right and uh, we just got done doing our two days of dyno training how'd that work out for you good very well well what are your takeaways from that gave us the, the basics of uh, of operating the dyno uh, how the air fuel how the air fuel mixture correlates with the VE tables um, got some uh, info on carburetor tuning diagnostic some of the ability to use the dyno for some diagnostic um, procedures we definitely need all everything to work together be like trying to run around with our shoes untied you know something's going to go wrong right? right but we definitely uh um spent a lot of time talking about not how to hurt things right you know how to work safe in there you guys i'm gonna do a little showcase of your shop here because this is a pretty amazing building how long you been open we started working here April. End of April, mid to end of April. Yeah. How'd you find out about me? Uh, I actually found you. I found you on the internet. Internet, cool. Thank you, YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, you know, these guys, uh, it was fun to work with you. You guys made it really fast for as much knowledge as you guys were already bringing in. I didn't have to sell you on safety or, you know, uh, what we need to do with the vehicle. We talked a lot about the before and after. I'm pretty excited for you guys to see what you, uh, what you have happen out of here. Um, the other thing that I offer was the business side of it. Some tips on that as far as uh, yep. work orders, management, even parts room training. Did you guys find any value in any of that? Absolutely. Yep. Yeah. Things to make things flow smoother, quicker and smoother, more efficient. Was there anything from that business or the parts side of it that you think you'll implement like right away? Maybe getting some parts up in the, out of the parts room into the showroom so yep. the customers can see them. Cool. Cool. And just double checking making sure everything that comes out of parts is on a repair order right, right. and i gave you that checklist to be able to create that accountability step yeah yeah awesome well i enjoyed working with you guys i hope uh between uh the dyno training 101 in particular and then the business side of it it was a good investment for you yes absolutely thank awesome. you you bet thank you my contact info in the comments down below if you're looking for some personal needs well, like I said, whether one-on-one, -on -one, FaceTime, or um, over the phone, email, just give me a shout and uh, I'm available for hire. So I want to thank you for tuning in. I want to thank these guys for uh, once again choosing me to come do their dyno training and business training and make it a great day. And as I always say, keep wrenching. I hope you found this video useful. 
If you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, would you please do so? Also hit that notification button so you'll know about all our future videos.